Alright guys, here we are with another episode of Bear and Bird. I don't know. Uh, Bear and Bird Simulator know. 2016. I, I don't know that movie yet. Can't use it. No. But I do know how to find a jigsaw piece. Oh, we He's got it. Made out of solid gold. This is this is literally worth more than my life. Like a wow. jigsaw piece that big. Well yeah, actually. Because like given the fact that, that Banjo's a grizzly bear. Yeah, that's a big That's piece. a really big piece of gold. And think of it, Kazooie's really big too, so is that backpack. This game is just full of really big things. So is that. Like, look at how much gold that is. Like, why doesn't Banjo just take that and buy himself a new sister? Honestly. Oh. <laughs> like, I don't I, I mean, it's not quite how that works. It could. It could be. We don't know what their society's like. That's true. Just buy, buy a Jinjo. Call it a sister. <laughs> Call it a sister. Just put a wig on it. I mean, maybe they, maybe some of them have hair. That picture's complete, and the door to Mumbo's Mountain is open. This is great. Is that? Is yeah, this... we pretty much beat the game already. Yeah, I was gonna say this is the end, right? Yeah, this is the last boss. That's this mountain. Wow. Beat it. Game's over. Oh, go home. I love it. This is the best game we've ever played. What the heck is this? This is like the after game. Oh. He said, oh, there's three new moves to learn. Okay, I see I see what you are saying. This is a Jinjo. Um, they're kind of weird. That's really all I have to say about them. Actually, uh, yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to go up this way. <sighs> now we're going to see if I can do this level in like one fluid motion. I highly doubt that. Yeah, I know you do. But I'm a skilled Banjo-Kazooie player. Unlike some of us who uh, rolled off a mountain a couple minutes ago. Let's remember rolled the fact off mountain. that he said he's a skilled Banjo-Kazooie player and let's use that against him later in the video. R rolled off a mountain. Oh, this is the move I just learned by the way. It's a, uh, it's kind of a fun one. Is that an attack move? Yeah, I mean it can be an attack move if you want to use it for that, but you don't have to. Oh, I missed one. No. That's that fluid motion. Yep, completely fluid, <laughs> like an avalanche. <laughs> more fluid than an avalanche. Ooh. Do you have to smash this? You don't have to, I just do. Okay. okay so there's so ten jiggies on each world, and there's a hundred... A hundred notes, and there's five Jinjo. So it's kind of like the coins from Mario, the red coins from Mario, and the stars from Mario. So it's a little like Mario 64, except every time you get a jiggy, you don't have to completely reset the level. Fair enough. Which was, I, I think, I found that to be extremely annoying in that game. I wish I could just go through and get all of the stars and not have to leave every time. Part of the platform, man. It was awful. It doesn't matter. So that move was the Talon Trot, which is this. It makes you move just really fast, and I'll probably use it for 90% of this game. Oh, but we don't have to run on this, do we? We can walk. And not be dicked by the camera, hopefully. These are like little health stations, and you can break them, and they'll stop talking. Um, sometimes they'll have bees, though, and if you hit them, the bees will chase you. And there's not really anything you can do about the bees other than use invincibility feathers, which you'll get in Clanker's Cavern. Gold, gold, gold! That monkey over there, that little chimp, he wants this. What's this orange? So we're gonna get it for Why? Him. I don't know. Because monkeys like oranges, I guess. Right? They're bigger fans of bananas. I think we do found you, Do you is. know that, though? Like, have you asked a monkey? Scientists have proved it. Um, he, maybe he wants to be a Kong, and that's his, uh, that's his chosen ammunition. Because they all shoot, they all shoot, like, fruit and nuts in the Donkey Kong game. Right? I wasn't sure what we were talking about. Donkey Kong or King Kong? Not King Kong, no. Why not? 
I don't like King Kong. What? Hey, he's just a giant monkey. There's not really anything. I mean, Donkey Kong like has orange grenades. What does King Kong have? Like, he's just big. He fights planes. Yeah. So on does the Don side of a um, like huge building. So does Donkey Kong probably. No, I I've never seen that. Well, in the first one, he's big. He's like King Kong size. He the Donkey Kong arcade game where he steals Peach Whoa, or whatever. Why did he is. get small? Then. I don't know because he stopped lifting. He, well, he, he, stopped, he stopped taking his protein shakes. Alright, so those are Mumbo tokens. Um, there's no set amount of those per level. Um, but the game throws so many at you, and you don't really need all the ones it gives you. Uh, you use them to talk to Mumbo Jumbo, who I will go see. Is he like your dad? He's like a witch doctor. He's. So, like your dad? Yeah, he's pretty much like me. He's pretty much my dad, yeah. Because they're both not real. Let's see if I can not die here. What are you doing? Come on. Oh, what? Oh, get wrecked. He's sneaky. How was it? You missed. Apparently. There we go. Got him. Better beat Conga, cause Conga ain't slick. I'm slick. Conga's kinda slick. Nah. Not as slick as me running in there. I just took two pieces of gold from him. What did he do? Now I gotta get out Made of here before friends. he stomps us. Alright, we out. Oh, 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 Baron Bird, not out. Baron Bird gonna go get some gold. I forgot. I always forget these. I don't know. And, and like, I think it's because of the, the way that I do the level. Like, I just kind of skip them. Wow. That's another trick. It's like, you see how I just, um, like how I beak dive or whatever that's called into the yeah. water. If you do that, the time that it takes you to get down, it won't deplete your air meter. So you can have uh, a little bit of extra time. Oh. So now, we normally would not be able to climb, oh, oh, we, uh, normally I would be able to climb up this cliff, but now that I know the town truck, oh, I can. That makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense. That doesn't make any sense. Actually, this move literally does not make any sense yes, at all. Yes, it does. No, because bears can run uphill better than most animals. You don't know what kind of bird that is, though. But I do know that that's a bear, and that bears can run uphill. You're assuming it's a bear. No, it's a bear. It's definitely, he's definitely a bear. That's an assumption. Uh, assumption based on the facts that we know. That he looks like that, a bear? That he is a bear. He doesn't sound like a bear. He doesn't sound like a bear, I agree. There you go. Bottles does not sound like a bowl. How do you know? Because I know what bowls sound like. Do you? Yeah. What do they sound like? They don't make any noise. How do you know? Because Maybe we you just, just haven't listened long enough. Yeah. What? <laughs> 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 that literally does not make any sense. How, how much time have you spent talking to moles? More than I should have. Really? Yep. That's kind of weird, actually. Yeah. Why? 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 I don't know. It's because I guess I think that Waddles needs friends, too, for his short life. Oh, gosh. You missed. Yeah, I know. That was awful. One fluid motion. You. Well, I'm doing pretty well so far, in my opinion. Uh, you would think that. Yeah, I, w I do. I would and do think that. That, that would make sense. Oh, I like these. These are gold. They're music notes. No, these are gold. You're assuming they're gold. That's actually true. It never tells you these are gold. Yeah. Alright, pal. What else could they be though? Like what what other plastic? We're gonna leave that actually. Because if we wanna cut down on time, the uh, the dance that he does when he collects them counts as time. So if I don't get those and I wait until I'm the termite 
it don't have the, this little animation that he does, it doesn't happen. So I can just get them and run. That makes sense. That's a good call. Because we're all worried about time. Yeah. Absolutely. We want to get the world's best time on this level. And then Mumbo decides that he has something important to say. And see that sign says that I need five Mumbo tokens. But joke's on him. I already got all the five Mumbo tokens. Uh, crazy, man. It's weird that he like uses his own currency. Like I have a hundred, I have seventy-five music, like gold music notes, but he wants those. Maybe they're worth more. The crystal skulls, basically. I don't think they're crystal. They look like they're silver. Silver skulls. All right. So now we. Oh my gosh. You uh... literally just kill me. I, oh my gosh. Can't jump. I, I can One jump. One fluid motion, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. <laughs> oh man, that's awful. I thought the last one I did, I saw the gold and I was like, that's a jiggy. It wasn't a jiggy. It was an extra life, which is literally useless in this game. <laughs> Most pointless so. thing. So we're not going to get the best time at all. That's a jiggy. That is a jiggy, yes. But can you jump as a uh, termite? Yeah. Okay. Hey, why would I need to jump? To keep the one that was up on the... Oh, up on the... Yeah, you can jump as the termite. Okay. I, if I can't jump high enough, though, I'm going to be really mad. Because remember, you have to jump inside the termite thing. Uh, that's true. <sighs> I'm going to laugh. What do you mean you're going to laugh? When, when, I, you can't, when I can't, it doesn't can't let me. Alright, so... Six, oh, seven... Eight. Wow, that was. Nine. We're just shitting. rolling in them. <laughs> I think that's the most jiggies I've ever collected in like five seconds. Same. I've never actually done that. And I feel like I should have. The amount of times oh. that I've played this game. Good jump. Oh my oh, gosh! Yeah. I know that you can do that, but I'm not gonna dick around with it anymore. Oh. Can I do it? Ladies and gentlemen, wow. I am a god. Made all the jumps. Oh my. Oh, taking the damage. Whatever. Worth. Got all the jumps. If that's what I have to do to make sure that I'll jump all the right times in the first. Like all the right ways in the first time, I'll absolutely do that. Unbelievable. Hey, look, another extra life. They're still useless. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, Banjo talks kind of weird, but we don't make fun of him. Or the same thing. Nine. I still don't take fall damage, which is still really nice. Still. Yeah, still. I don't know why I said still. Actually, now that you mention it. All right, so there's two of those per level. Um, there's six in the in the top world, but that's just because that's the way that it is. That's pretty neat. <laughs> Are we, are we Nietzsche Walk now? Yeah. Shout out to Nietzsche Walk. Um, I'll probably put an annotation in there for them. Because they're hilarious. If you haven't watched the video, and you're wasting your time watching this dumb video, go watch that video instead. After you're done watching this, because we care about our viewers. And that's 100 music notes. And because which is I care about life. our viewers, you guys do what you want. If you guys want to not watch the rest of this video, you go right ahead. What are you talking? No. At this point, literally, you can do leave. not do that. Go make yourself a sandwich. Treat yourself. T okay, treat yourself. Yeah, absolutely. But yeah. maybe if just put it on your phone, take it out with you. You can do that too. But I mean, it, if you're really bored, I understand. Uh, but, uh, I just want to go up this mountain bottles, get my jigsaw piece. And, and then, do you basically? So if you if you try to leave as this ant, Mumba will tell you his magic's weak, and you have to turn around, or else you won't be a termite. But jokes on him. I'm a bear. Like that. He knows you're a bear. He's the one that turned you into a termite. Mumbo doesn't know that. What? Nope. Didn't tell him. I was a dog the whole time. <laughs> Maybe he's like a person. Maybe they're both people. But Mumbo just turned him into something. Maybe. Oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe everyone in this game used to be a human character. 
But Mumbo just one day was like, no, you're animals now. Like, this, actually, this could have been Zelda. And then... And then Mumbo came in. Mumbo came up. Wow, that's everyone. a weird thought. All right, so basically what Bottles is telling us is we need at least 50 notes to break the door. But what's that? We've already got 100. We don't need that. Yeah. Ten out of ten. All right. Ten. What door again? Ten out what? All right. So now I'm gonna screw up this guy. Ooh. Just pecked him in the face. All right. So these cauldrons down here. Um. I meet it and it turns purple. And if I had found another purple one and I jump in it like that, it'd send me to that other purple cauldron, like all the way across the map. Um. So, so those are helpful. It's like the portal gun from Portal. Well, every time you start this game back up, it'll start you at the entrance to this castle. So it'll start you all the way down in that first room. There. I wonder what that's gonna be. Um, the music's making me think of the pirate level. So basically, he's telling me that I can take things out by pressing the down button. Um, but once I complete the picture like that, they're always there. And then, what the heck? We got Treasure Trove Cove, we got arrows, Ooh. we got feathers, we got... This is gonna a, be great. ...the captain of a boat that doesn't work. You All guys kinds are of gonna cool love stuff there. The, this next level. It's what are you? one of a kind. Oh, that's Grunty's... Tooth Fairy. Sister? I don't remember. One of her sisters. Tooth Fairy. Alright, well, um, I think that's it for this video. Alright, everyone. So, we'll see you next time in the Pirate Bay. I'm again Treasure Trove Cove. Alright, uh, see you guys. Good night, everyone.